Hello everyone, this is BCS Buster, and welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy Legend 3. Last time we made it back to the present time, and we've uh, made a second trip to the underwound underwater town of Mew. I want to show you what I have real quick here. Um, just a reminder from last time, I got all my new magic and all my new weapons, and so I'm ready to get going. Now, we want to explore the, some of the underwater, because things have changed since we've returned to our time. There's a ship right over here. Let's go check this out. A couple treasure chests we want to definitely get. We receive the air crystal, that's going to be useful later in the game. And a tear gas, and that's going to be useful very quickly. And I'll show you where we're going to use that. Oh, i got some new enemies here along with the warrior. we got a ghost. Let's try some fire magic. I think I think they're um, I think they're strong against tornado. Ooh. Okay, fortunately that's not very strong. Okay, that's why I thought they were weak against fire. Undead monsters are in most games are typically weak against fire. Ooh, and that lightning magic didn't seem to kill them, so. You gotta watch out for these ghosts. They can be kinda tricky, as you can see. But we got a nice gold sword, and that should take care of that guy. All right, good. Ouch. All right, no problem. All right, let's uh, just do that. And let's keep this going. Sweet. I don't know why, those go I don't know why the ghost feels it's important to stick its... Hey! Stick its tongue out at us. But... Well, I guess he multiplied, so that means we get more experience. Because if it multiplies... There we go. Now, the reason that I could kill him so quickly is because when he multiplied, he multiplied with the same HP as before. Alright. Nice job, team. Ooh, 71 experience. That's pretty good. And we don't want to eat the meat. Most meat in this game you actually don't want to eat. I, I, found that it, I find that it really weakens your characters. And um, the abilities that you gain from them really aren't that good. In my opinion, anyway. There's only a couple transformations that are really, really strong. Alright. Well, we're done with that. Let's head back this way. I believe I want to go over here. Yep. Okay. We now have a place that's completely surrounded by volcanoes. Whatever shall we do? Let's go ahead and return to the surface. Move over three or four squares. And resurface. And now we can get in here. And there's another shipwreck. So let's check out this final shipwreck. Ooh, an earth crystal. Excellent. Alright, let's keep moving along here. And one more chest. Alright, the thunder staff. Alright. Well, that's all the underwater treasures we can get, so let's go ahead and get out of here. Alright, let's try to get out of here. There we go. Let's go ahead and resurface. Okay, now we want to head over here. And back to the mainland. Okay, let's go see what Kronos has found over here in Elan. I'm going to make the short trip here. Kronos is in the same location as he was the first time. So it's just down in this big house. The people say all the same thing, and the shops sell all the same things. All right, Kronos, what you got for us, buddy? Ooh, he knows where the future unit excellent is. Excellent. Ah, there's Ashura. Where have we heard that name before? All right. Uh-oh. Oh, that's not good music. Oh, man, something's in the bay. That's not good. Let's check it out. Whoa. It's a monster. No, it's just a castle. So, it's either Chaos or Matria. No, we got to be fast. Oh, good. We have the tower key now, though. Okay, we great. We can get into the, the, get into the castle there. All right. But, oh, it's Chaos that dwells in that castle. Okay, great. Well, we'll deal with him in a minute. Let's, um, we need to get that unit first from uh, Ashura, get that future unit. Okay, I'm going to heal up, and I'll meet you guys outside. Whatever's going to happen next. All right, I'm all healed, ready to go. Let's do this. Now, the South Tower, if you may remember, or maybe you don't, I don't know, is down this way. And we're going to go past, we're going to bypass that castle for now. We're gonna head over here. And just follow the path. Just continue following the path here. Let's head up this way. And there's the stuff. Hey, what's that? It looks like a big hot air balloon with a face. 
Oh, it's the eye from Tree. And he can apparently talk. Yeah, I thought the same thing. I just did. <laughs> nice. Okay. Are there units around here? That's a good question. All right, I sure it does have. Great. All right, let's do this. We'll use the tower key. All right, let's go. Now, what you're going to notice about this castle is it's laid out very similarly, very similarly to um, the first castle that we went through. So that'll make getting around a lot easier. Whoops. Didn't mean to do that. Stupid me. Sorry about that, viewers. Okay. Let's head up this way. And we got some new enemies here. We've got a brigand. And, um... We're just gonna do the same thing we did. Just use our lightning attacks and... Uh-oh. We didn't kill him in one shot? That's not good. Hopefully we can take them out, though. Okay, good. Whew. Okay, well, we definitely just want to keep our attacks up. We gotta take these guys out. Ow. Man, that's a pretty powerful attack. You need to be careful. The enemies are, start, are gonna start to get tough. Much tougher. There we go. Got him. Sweet. Boom! Got him. Alright. And take care of him. Excellent. Now, once again, because this, there's a boss coming up, you don't want to save your magic. Even though the boss isn't that tough. Um, always want to be conservative with your magic in these situations. Alright, we got him. And 60 experience. is pretty good. Okay, now I'm going to go ahead and not fall down there again. Going to the south leads to a dead end. But going this way leads to a blackjack. And that's a very good weapon for uh, your main hero. So we're going to put that on. Nope, not the tear gas. There it is. Now again, your attack power is not going to change, but your your weapon is actually stronger. Okay, so this way. Nothing to the south, so let's head up to this floor. Lots of holes. So let's jump over this. And some more new enemies. We got a mushroom and a busybody. So let's just go ahead and take go ahead and take these guys out. And we'll show off the power of that new weapon. Oops. Uh no, you want to use. There we go. Oops. No, whatever. Ouch. Ooh, phew. Good thing I only hit one time. We're just spreading out our attacks, so balance them out a little bit. So that we can defeat them in one go. Oof. And Glory's getting low on HP. I should probably heal her up. Take care of that. Excellent. I hit twice. Yeah, I think they can only do damage. Oh, nice shot. Good job. All right, well, let's, let's, um, anyways, what I was saying is, um, they'll definitely do much less damage if it only hits one time, which is a good thing. All right, let's try some fire magic. Uh, let's do it this way. Oops. And fire magic. For some reason, I want to say these guys are weak against fire. Or it can just miss. That's fine, too. Nope, I was wrong. It's always good to mix up your attacks. Um, just try experiment with some different things. Um, kind of see what they're weak to. Boom! That b a very good weapon. Ow. She's probably need some healing. Ooh, yeah, she definitely needs some healing. Okay, well, let's, uh... Let's get you some healing real quick. And we'll use some character magic there. Hey, come on, leave my characters alone. Battles actually take a little bit longer than usual in this game. Probably should have killed them first. Oh well, whatever. There we go. She's back in the game. Boom. And we got him. All right. Nice. And 75 experience. Well deserved. Okay. Let's go this way here. And we receive an air crystal. Jump over the chest. And jump over this way and get a TNT. Awesome. Okay. Now the only way to... Uh, to get back up here is to go down the floor and come back up. So I'll meet you once I'm back at the entrance to the next floor. Alright, I've made it back up. Let's keep on going. It's a very short floor here. So we we'll head up this way. And there is the boss, Ashura. Now I'm going to take a moment and uh, heal up. Actually, I'm actually going to stop because I'm almost out of time. So in between episodes, I will heal up. And next time, we will have the exciting boss battle versus Ashura. But until then, this is BCS Buster signing off. Take care, y'all.